Hello everyone! Welcome back to my channel, The Genius and Better Kids. Yo, 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 yo. So for today, I'm going to be teaching you on how to make your own mini bowl. It's simple and easy to make. You can even jot down things inside, like I've already started doing. Wow. So let's start. So you can write any information on this. Because it's your daughter. So you're going, you're going to be needing a four sheet. You can use one if you want, but I want the pages to be more. Then you are going to be folding it from the down to the top. Okay. Fold it. Then you are going to be folding it again. So after I fold it from the down to the top, it will be like this. So you turn it like this and fold it to the down to the top. And after you fold it, then you turn it like this and fold it. Alright. Now, you are just going to be opening it. And then going to be getting some lines. So you are just going to be cutting everything. So you can use the easier method of cutting it. You just fold it well. You are just going to be cutting it all together. Alright, so I have cut it. And now, the top two will be folded, so you are just going to be cutting the one too. So the easier way, you just open one of the fold right into the middle, then just put the other one into it. Then you cut it. Easiest method. Alright. So make sure you separate all the pages one by one. So you see the one which aren't cut. Like this one. Just be cutting it. Okay. Alright. And now you're just going to be folding everything in order. Arranging them in order. So you can do the book in any shape or size or in any style. So instead of doing it straight, you can just leave it like this if you want to. Alright, so I've arranged them. So now you are just going to be taking your glue and you are just going to be then you glue the sides. So make sure you put enough glue so everything will stick together. And as I said earlier, you can either put it at the top or at the sides. It's depending on how you want it. So I'm going to be gluing it. So I'm done growing it. So as it's drying, I'm just going to keep it aside. And I'm just going to be taking another A4 sheet to make the cover. Every book or just has a cover. So you need to make it. So for the cover, you're just going to take a rectangle of A4 sheet and your marker. And I'm just going to be designing it with horizontal and vertical lines. So I'm going to be doing it all through. So you can do the book in any size you want, whether big or small. Instead of buying your book and jot it outside, you can just make some yourself for your personal use. Okay. So you 
have a pattern like this. They are just going to be taking your book. So I'll that. Then you're just going to be turning it over. You're just going to be gluing your book to the cover. Alright. So when you're done gluing it, then you can cut wherever you want to cut up. Uh, apply some glue and I'll glue one side and I'll turn it over and glue the other side okay um, closing it and I'll glue it and wait for it to dry all right, so I'm just going to be opening it. Yeah, bro. So now I'm just going to be trimming this part out. But don't trim everything out. You just trim some small little parts from all the sides. Okay, so now as you have seen this surface here, they are just going to be folding everything this one here, right at the back. So I'm just going to be gluing this side and the other side. So I'm just going to be cutting the down and the top, a line in the middle. There you go. So I'm almost done. Well, halfway there. So here it is. It will give your book a very nice design. So as we are done with the inside, we are just going to be dealing with the outside. So I'm just going to be making a lock. You can't close it. But it's not that locking. You just open it. Anytime you want. So you take a rectangular, a small rectangular if for suit with the designs on them. I'm just going to be folding here and there together. So I'm going to be folding the top and the bottom together. Okay. Make sure it's glued. Then you're just going to be, you are going to have something like this. Then you are just going to be putting it at the middle of your book. And just going to be gluing it. Make sure the glue dry. Alright, they are just going to be taking another long rectangular for sheet that can enter here. They are just going to be gluing one side at the back. Make sure it dries. Then here you have it. You can open your book and close it. So here I go. So now I'm just going to be adding some designs like I did for the first one. Hmm, what should I do? I was going to be writing J. J. I'm just going to be coloring it so it will be visible. And I'm just going to be removing this rough part away with my scissors. Hey, I meant you love. Know. 
All right. So there you go. Your own mini book. Oh, Jata. With cardboard. So as I said, you can make any size you like. Wow. It's so wonderful. Uh, all you need is your A4 sheet glue and your marker. So thank you everyone for watching the channel. This was the Genius Inventor Kit. We'll see you next time with more videos. The Genius Inventor Kit. Bye bye. God bless you.